Well, there remain so many questions about a brutal hammer attack that has devastated one Brooklyn family. A woman and her two children were attacked earlier this week by a suspect with a hammer. Police say the mother has since died of her injuries, and her six-year-old son and three-year-old daughter remain here at Bellevue Hospital in critical condition. 47-year-old Lee Young-Yi walked out of a police precinct with his head held low. This is video of the moments he was arrested, obtained by PIX11 News. When I saw the babies, I heard the police screaming that get him, get him, get him. And he was trying to run away. And uh, they arrested him right up uh, like middle of the block. It is sad. Police allege Yi fatally attacked 43-year-old mother Zhao Zhao with a hammer and seriously injured her children. Each rented a room inside of an illegally subdivided apartment in Sunset Park, Brooklyn. I came out and at that time I see the two police officers running and one had a baby clutched like that with all blood all over and the second officer had the same thing, baby. Police say Yi's own son saw the attack take place as well as his father allegedly trying to run away. Initial reports say the attack may have been motivated by noise, but New York State Assemblyman Lester Chang says there may have been a different motive. I had been told uh, third party information is yes, they might have some argument amongst themselves who's paying the rent, but, but that's argument is all financial. Assemblyman Chang tells us Zhao's husband is a restaurant worker in Ohio who comes back and forth to the family's apartment in Sunset Park. He adds a third man also lived in the apartment. All three are tenants. That's, that's confirmed. We are told this morning that the children's father remains by their bedside here at Bellevue Hospital. Meantime, as for Yi, he faces several charges, including murder, attempted murder, and criminal possession of a weapon. That is the latest from Kips Bay. Kieran Dillon, PIX11 News. Okay, Kieran.